championship you know I lost the week before in the Big 12 championship to Texas A&M and I think double or triple overtime so here they were the number four team in the country um, you know and, and, and we had the opportunity to play them we had made our fair share of mistakes uh, special teams wise but still felt like we had the game well within hand and then all of a sudden they make a late run in the fourth quarter um, Michael Bishop and crew and uh, they took the lead 34 30 so here we are having to go into you know two minute mode and that last drive was wild I um, I remember we got to a third and ten on the very first, you know, possession of that, of that, uh, or yeah, first set of downs on that drive, and then we got a, a big third down, and then we got another big completion, and then a pass interference, and then I think I ran the ball out of bounds, and and here we were with about 30 seconds left, and I remember the play like it was yesterday because it was one of my favorite plays. Um, Isaac Jones, uh, who was our best receiver, senior uh, receiver, captain, um, was in the slot to my right. And um, he, he got a great release on the DB, got inside, and it was kind of a, a pseudo fade route, but from the inside receiver position. The outside guy just ran a hitch to tie down the corner, and here he was running one on one. Um, but had to be very crafty with, with how he ran that route because he had to go inside his defender, and then there was a middle safety who was running over there to intercept him as well. Um, but was a, he gave me a great place to kind of lay the ball over his shoulder, and um, he did all the work, made a great catch. And, um, I know how exciting it was for us, I know how exciting it was for everybody watching, regardless who you were rooting for, um, it was certainly a game to remember for everyone.